Hi, I'm Nick Haraz of Creative 111, here to welcome you to Metal's Master Series Cinematic 360 VR production with Skybox Suite inside of Adobe Premiere Pro and After Effects. I think one of the greatest parts of this class that you're about to embark on is that it's hands-on, meaning that you can download some footage and follow along directly inside of Adobe Premiere Pro and Adobe After Effects. Absolutely brand new to Metal, and I've never tried their products before. Keep in mind that you can download a free trial by heading to metal.com and going to some of the products that will be mentioned later here in the class. Now, before we embark on this lovely VR journey, I wanted to give you guys a breakdown of some of the topics that we'll be covering throughout this course. So some of the topics that we're going to be covering include an overview of VR 360 video. What exactly is VR? What was it? And how is that similar or different to 360 video, which is what we're going to be doing inside of this class? We're going to look at what happens before the edit. So right after production, we've got all of this footage from various cameras and we need to do something with it. We need to stitch it together. So we're going to look at what we do before we it actually even touches Premiere Pro and After Effects. We're going to look at optimizing your workstation. And what I mean by this is just making sure that you have a proper workstation to deal with the heavy demands of VR that's going to put on your system. On top of this, we're going to look at some of the basics of working with VR footage inside of Premiere, everywhere from importing clips inside of Premiere to looking at Premiere Pro's VR capabilities and all of our VR clips into a sequence and then look at where metal comes into play by offering these amazing transitions and effects specifically for your VR workflows. Finally, we're going to send one of our clips over to After Effects and look at some of Metal's tools inside of there for a simple rig removal using Skybox. When our project is set and finished, we're going to export our VR clips to YouTube with the handy help of Adobe Media Encoder. So if those topics sound great to you, join me here in chapter one. We're going to learn all this stuff of VR workflow before it actually even comes inside of Premiere Pro. I'll see you in the next movie.